Hi, my name is Josh Stewart, and I'm going to demonstrate Dragon Medical version 10.1. Dragon Medical is the most widely used speech recognition system in medicine today. It essentially allows you to dictate in virtually any Windows-based or Citrix-based application or EMR and EHR systems. You can produce documents three times faster, and it includes almost 80 medical specialties and subspecialties. So no matter what type of practice you are, Dragon's got a vocabulary model that's going to fit. Dragon Medical also supports HIPAA regulation patient confidentiality guidelines, which is very important for medical speech recognition, right? It's got full EMR and EHR support, regional and global accents are supported, and it is available in English, German, Dutch, and French. Let's get started. We're going to start off our demonstration today by talking about dictating. Basic dictating, what you say will be transcribed onto the screen. Now, as I said earlier, when you dictate into Dragon, you can dictate at up to 160 words per minute. Now, this includes any Windows-based application that you can talk into or any Windows or Citrix-based EMR or EHR system. Essentially, anywhere that you can type, you can turn on your microphone and start dictating. Now, Dragon Medical lets you dictate in your own words, so physicians don't need to change their style. Dragon is going to work the way that you work. That's how it was designed. Dragon Medical also lets you navigate your computer, you know, opening and closing windows, moving between uh, documents, any of that fun stuff. So using Dragon will allow medical professionals to reduce the time spent documenting care and allow you to spend more time with the patient itself. With that said, let's get started. We're going to open up Microsoft Word and dictate a sample note here. Start dictation. Dear Dr. Taylor, comma, new paragraph. I had the pleasure of seeing Frank Williams in my office today, period. The patient was admitted to the hospital in early November with decompensated congestive heart failure, comma, which was precipitated by recurrent atrial fibrillation, period. New line. Since discharge, he has been feeling better without significant dyspnea on exertion, but does have fatigue, period. The symptoms have substantially improved since prior to hospitalization, period. He has no edema, comma, orthopnea, or PND, period. New line. Other problems include COPD, and he did have mild respiratory wheeze on evaluation today, period. He remains on inhalation therapy, and I will see him again in six months, period. He will follow up with his family doctor in the next month, comma, and with his electrophysiologist who will plan placement of an ICD for sudden death prophylaxis, period. New line. Please do not hesitate to call my office as needed, period. I certainly appreciate participating in Mr. Williams' care, period. What you've seen here is everything that I've dictated into the microphone was typed onto the screen. Right? That's the whole purpose of speech recognition. Now, you may be looking at the bottom bar on the bottom, the little window that has all the text in it. What's going on there is Dragon is listening to my voice, and it's taking my voice and converting it into text. Now, in some situations, words can sound very similar. For example, ice cream sounds a lot like ice cream. So Dragon takes those words and it studies the statistical probability based on the writing style of which word it should be used. So therefore, the information goes into the results box, then into your document. Now you can hide that results box if you want it to. Now that we've finished dictating our document, you know it's time to review, make any corrections or editing or formatting changes that are necessary. Now before we go into correcting or editing our playback, I want to talk about the Philips Speech Mic and the Philips Device Control Center. And the reason is, is because that is going to help me with all of these other features. So for a moment, we're going to go ahead and minimize Microsoft Word and we're going to bring up some information about the Philips Speech Mic, and then we'll wrap it all in and it'll make sense to you. 
We took a break from our dictation to discuss the Philips speech mic. Now, the reason is, is because the speech mic brings a lot of value to Dragon Medical. And it's because it's a handheld USB microphone with programmable buttons. So as I'm dictating during this demonstration, this is the device that I'm using. As you can see on the front of the speech control, and this is the software that comes with the speech mic, we've got our certified uh, Dragon logo. So it was designed for use with Dragon Naturally Speaking. Many of the buttons on the speech mic itself are already pre-programmed to perform key functions within Dragon Medical. Peek at the application itself. On the right shows the device I'm using. I've got this nice little wireless speech mic with the programmable buttons on it. On the left-hand side is how you program those buttons. Now, like I said, it is pre-programmed for use with Dragon Medical. However, you can go through and change some of the features to make it more applicable for what it is that you're doing. In my case, I've programmed the record button to control the microphone in Dragon. I've programmed the rewind and fast forward buttons to jump around within templates that I create. The play button will start playback and the function key will open up a hidden mode. Now a lot of these features we haven't even discussed yet. You're going to see in a little bit how having this speech mic makes Dragon that much more of a productivity tool. Now let's jump back to our demonstration. Once we've completed dictating our document, we want to review it. Now we can do it now, or we can always save the audio later, because Dragon synchronized the audio with the text, which means I can just have my cursor wherever I want to, or I can move it around within my document. Now on my speech mic, if I press play, it will play back the audio, and it will follow along with the words. Watch this. I had the pleasure of seeing Frank Williams in my office today, period. The patient was admitted to the hospital in early November with decompensated congestive heart failure, comma, which was precipitated by recurrent atrial fibrillation, period. New line. Since discharge, he has been feeling better without significant dyspnea on exertion, but does have fatigue, period. The symptoms have substantially improved. So as you see, it highlights each word, making it very easy to review and or correct any problems that may be found in the document. Maybe instead of COPD, you meant to say something else, or maybe there was a misrecognition in the program. Having the ability to easily review this is key. Another thing that we can do is edit by voice. So let's say again, maybe I want to see the patient again in five weeks, and I accidentally said six months. Well, I can always turn on my microphone and say, select six months, five weeks. And as you see, Dragon made a change to the document. In addition to editing, there's also formatting. Now, there's a lot of fun things regarding formatting in the medical edition. The first thing let's talk about is quick voice formatting which means if I have anything in this document here that I want to change, I don't even need to select it first if I don't want to. I can just you know, tell my application what to do. Things like bold Frank Williams, underline November, italicize PND, and it just does it for me. So now I have full control of my application. That's quick voice formatting. There's also special medical formatting rules. So when you buy the medical edition and you go up on your Dragon Bar to Tools and Formatting, you have a whole bunch of things. Now as you see, each one of these tabs